Mimi nataka tu nieleze. Ni concept gani hiyo ya ku describe mtu? Wewe sasa mtu ataka ku describe aje unasikia unasikia hizo features ndio ujue huyo ni wewe. Azim <laughs> politics manaishi tu na kujishuku. Acha ni kushuku kuna, kuna kitu moja mimi ogopa ni siku gado atachora katuni yangu unajua? Ju o jamaa anaweza kukuchora mpaka yenyewe. Hata wewe mwenyewe uone yenyewe kuna venye labda mother alikuangusha kwa mtu huyu kichwa. Kichwa kichwa kaingana huku. So uh, uh, sijui venye mtu anaweza ni describe lakini si ngoje gado ni masikio tu. But sasa <laughs> We, masikio tu itakuwa description poa yeah. but hapo kwa yeah. eh, inaitwaje hizo ma delaying tactics yeah. ulikuwa una to explain hiyo story yeah. kuna tactics. kuna mawakili wao fanya vitu kama hizo of course uh, ume, umecheki kama sasa hizi judiciary inajaribu kutoa hizo vitu uh, kuna vitu wamejaribu kupitisha wanasema mtu wa kwenda adjournments kama tatu unapatiwa unaambiwa hii hii ni final adjournment uh, lakini unajua kuna vitu zingine wezi control for instance um, msaki claim ni mgonjwa unaona Yes. Hawezi argue na daktari yake, unacheki hiyo ndio kitu moja. Uh, mtu akuja aseme amekuwa bereaved, Ina, unajua inakuwa vigumu ana kushuko na matanga homa au kitu kama hiyo. Time zingine ni magistrate mwenyewe hayuko. Time nyingine there is all sorts of factors. Lakini najaribu ku uh, encourage watu kwa sababu tunaona maraga at least anajaribu kusukuma vitu zikwepoa. Uh, analeta changes one by one uh, kuhakikisha kwamba at least trials zinaendelea. Na hiyo kitu inakuwaga uh, judge moja kianza kusikiza kesi, ya? Yeah? Alafu tuseme pigwe transfer juu. Sahi kama policy hiko, wezi maliza station moja meka tatu. Pia wanajaribu kupunguza. Hiyo story ya watu kujuana. Unajua kishi pali okay. sana. Yeah. E, muna, muna kuwa nikawa we ni mwenyeji pali watu wanaanza kuku approach. Ni, yes. Muna washa yeah. nao, siju nini. Yeah. Munaanza kuzoyana. <laughs> so, wame introduce yo policy wanasema three years unapigwa transfer. So hata mimi kuna files zangu kwa mfano kule Mombasa uh, judge Walanza amepigwa transfer na Busia. Yes. So kesi yangu ita e, file yangu itapele kwa mbele uh, another judge. So ni nyinyi kama parties mu determine whether mnataka uh, judge mpya endelee na ile record ya ule judge mzee ama unataka mwanze fresh. Mwanze fresh. So una, unakuta kuna mawakili wengine wa oh, insist kila wakati tuanze fresh. Yaani tu ku delay hiyo. Ku delay time na ku yeah. make more. Yeah. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Na kuna wasipia wanatumia court kama weapon no. ya punishment. Yes. Diambuwa kuna style flani ya mtu wakiwa na noma na wewe, mm. ama mtu wanataka kukupunish, mm. ukaendani indefinitely, mm. anakuja, anaenda na kureport. Akisha kureport, anakuacha unayekuwa ndani kidogo, as in unayekuwa tu ndani, alafa anaenda. Yeah, one of so inamanisha th- uta wai toka, mbake ili siku watakamu. One of the things tumekuwa tukikomplain, uh, hata hiyo time tulikuwa tunavurugana na gavol kwa natudandia daily, Tukua na wasemani kuna abuse of police power kwa hii country. Uh, unacheki kama there is no uh, justification kwa arrest mutio yote Friday yani. Because unajua vizuri ujama umpeleke kotini. But the problem has so been... So sayi tunaelewa wa itito? Eh, tunaelewa. So the, the, the problem has been that uh, unajua public, public wao fry sana. Yaani wao fry sana wasikitu mtu wamelala ndani. Kuna utamuflani. Kuna utamuflani yeah. kuzi jui na toka kwa wapi. Wasikitu yaani kama yota kulikuanga na story mob za head speech nini. Wakadandiani hata kina madha kama Florence Mutua. Yaani watu hata wakisomewa charge sheet kutini watu wanacheka juu. Yaani I make sense yote. Lakini the fact that tunataka kupigana na hiki tunaita head speech. Unacheki wote wanasundu ndani. In fact wa ititu walikuwa moja wao yota time. Kina junet wakalala pangani for oh, the six days. So unakuta, <laughs> unakuta watu wana fry tu kwa sababu wameskia mtu wameshika, mtu wameshika mel, amelala ndani. And also it comes from the realization of the public that sometimes probably we will not get a conviction at the end of the case. So you, we will take what we will get. If all we will get is somebody spending a, a weekend at the courts, ni sawa. Hata you know, kama it doesn't yes, mean it. unaona sa hizi watu wana protest, watu wakipewa cash bail. Yet wao wenyewe, hao wameka hapa, walipitisha katiba inasema kila mtu wapewe cash bail. Wali vota hawa, ok, uyo anda itin moja tu ndo tunaza msamea. Hawa ngine wote hawa, wali votia katiba, unaona? Yeah. Ikasema kila mtu pewe, cash bill. So, watu kipewa cash bill saizi, unasikia watu wanalia, wanasema oo, oh, judiciary ya itusaidi kufight corruption. Nyi wenye ndo mulisema mtu pewe, cash bill. Ok, yeah. na in terms of structures za vile law you work, yeah. saizi, county assemblies zimestopiwa kufa, kuendelea na debate ya punguza mzigo. Yes. Eh, nyinyi ODM uh, kun, as in kuna unity flani against ekuru au court yeah. ndio hiyo story yake ya punguza mzigo yeah. is it advance. First Kwa of all we una... umetrend ume juzi sana kwa sababu ulisa umali KBC iko. <laughs> eh. First of all acha niseme hiyo hiyo characterization kwanza mimi nakataa. Unacheki eh, hata nilikuwa nakupigia story kabla tuanze kama sasa headline ya leo ya, ya Nation. Uh, walikuwa na charibu kwa advance kitu watisamu hau, odiemi na sikia wivu, 
ati sijui tu hao jamaa walifikisha hizi hizi signature sisi hatukufikisha amsikii wewe eh, unajua ile kitu na, nawaambia eh, mtu anaota jua na mtu anaota mwezi sio the same yani we don't share this <laughs> what can you explain what can you explain as in our sisi ati tunashare spotlight na wao kuna check waswahili husema Okay. Yaani lizard itabaki tu lizard hata ujaze chakula aje hizi kuwa mamba unacheki so hatuko competition na wao so kitu tunawaambia kubadilisha katiba sio compare at, at beauty pageant at kuona nani anapendwa hapana hii ni serious discussion so gazeti kama yenu nation gazeti nzito inatakana i break down contents za hiyo bill alafu i break down ag, uh, zile arguments against hiyo bill ndio wa Kenya wajue ni nini inaendelea So si tumejaribu ku break down hiyo bill. Atusemi ati ule jamaa ame propose ni sura mbaya ama atumlike. Tunasema <laughs> tunasema kuna kuna vitu pale ndani kuna vitu pale ndani haziwezi work. Unacheki kama sasa hii kwa mfano uh, wanasema yani kaunti nzima for instance Nairobi iko na constituency 17. Ikuwe constituency moja tunachagua watu wawili wa kwa MP. Unacheki ana claim hiyo reduce uh, uh, mzigo. Unaenda kaunti zingine kama Migori kwa, kwa mfano kuna communities zenye ni ndogo kama Wakuria for a long time umekuwa kilia juu eh, majority ya watu pale ni Wajaluo okay. so ukipiga kura tu unachagua watu wawili Wajaluo all, all the time watakuwa tu na run rough shoot over our say unacheki hakuna mkuri atawahi shinda kura sasa hizi wako na representation wawili huko kwetu pia inatoka kuna wasio naitwa sabaut wanaishi sasa za Mount Elgon Bungoma ni kaunti yenye mejao wa bugusu ukisema kura sasa hizi au wa sabaut they never get representation unacheki Saizi wa mama wenye wako ubunge wako 97. Yeye yeah, anasema tukate namba ya wamadha irudi kitu kama uh, 47 maximum. Unacheki? Begs the question. Yes. Hata before uendelee, yeah. ukisema wase wase wenye ati tuseme mali wa sabaoto wako ama yeah. wakuri wako hata yeah. representation. Yeah. Why can't we advance an agenda ya yeah. mkuri ya mali yako yeah. akiripresentativa na msewa tribe nyingine yeah. bado interest zake zitakuwa sawa sasa hiyo argument tumekuwa nayo before unajua hii history ya hii katiba ni kitu lazima to study mm-hmm. to, there was a time when that was the case but you know Kenya is a very peculiar country unacheki hizi issues zote zilikuwa canvassed hiyo wakati na ika, ika, it came out very clearly that it is not always possible for people to feel represented by people who don't look like them unacheki So unakuta some, sometimes eh, watu wanapiga tu kelele wanasema hiki kitu inapunguza mzigo. Hakuna mzigo inapunguza. First of all budget nzima ya bunge. The whole budget ya bunge ni 36 billion mwaka moja. Ile do wameiba Aror na Kimware ni 18. Hiyo ni nusu ya budget ya, ya bunge. So oh, badala tu address. Oh, oh, oh. So no, ni balance. Ni balance hii, hii kitu, kama ingekuwa imeibwa the same. Acha sisi atikuibwa the same. Ile kitu nakuambia. Ukiangalia budget ya state house ya entertainment, chai, mandazi uangalie budget ya ofisi ya deputy president peke yake mishahara magari ni the same na counties mbili ya location yani uchukue allocation ya Mombasa na Nairobi uweke pamoja hiyo ndo budget ya ofisi ya DP chai. alafu sasa unaambia watu chai na entertainment ni ma- majana lisinyi ndo enda kunywa chai huko setup so <laughs> so <laughs> so kama kama ni conversation ya kusema tupunguze mzigo enyewe tupunguze mzigo kwa nini kila ministry kila mwaka inanunua magari mpya hata unashangaa yani prado ya kama sasa sisi tunaendesha gari ziko sijui 7 years old zile tume import unacheki yes. lakini ministry ina buy gari every year ukiangalia budget zao za magari uangalie entertainment budget office ya first lady waja, unajua hizi vitu lazima tuongee office ya first lady budget yake inashinda budget ya hizo independent commission zote zile unasikianga kina TSC ya IBC yote so i, ikiwa tunataka ku have an honest conversation ya kupunguza mizigo hizo ndo place tunaangalia tuache kudanganyana ati ukitoa half of bunge ibaki 18 billion atume save do na pesa bado watu wanaiba na saju mko ndani ya handshake no. technically mko ndani ya serikali yeah. mbona mpeani hizi ideas poa poa ifo ile kitu miwaambia watu first of all eh? uh, the best implementer wa plan yako ni we mwenyewe unajua wewe venye umekaa hivi ukaichoro me envision hata ukijaribu ku explain ya msini kama sasa hivi venye najaribu na struggle kukufundisha <laughs> Yaani with, with all due respect na sasaani bale mimi idea yako idea yako hata tuseme vile wewe uli conceivisho sasa nimekubali eh? mimi si chopi wa corruption okay sawa basi ni accept ni accept vile wewe uli conceivisho 
Yeah. Yaani hata ukijaribu ku explain ya mtu mwingine labda hashiki hiyo concept unaona. Kuna watu wengine lazima tu we mwenyewe tu ndio unaweza bring out issue vile iko. Unacheki. Mm -hmm. So venye tuseme umeanzisha hizo eh, wewe ukitoka hapa saa hizi wapatie fala mwingine ajaribu pia hiyo kazi. <laughs> Utakuta na mshinda kwa sababu yeye yeah, hajawahi ku envision ati tunaweza have a serious discussion kama hii yeah. in such a context unaona. Yeah. So ile kitu tunasema ndio there's uh, a certain uh, changes zime happen kwa sababu ile time ilikuwa ni Jacoma na shauti ya Mombasa uh, uhuru na shauti ya Nyeri alafu nyinyi kazi yenu ilikuwa kuleta pamoja hizo umbea unajua wewe unatuma cameraman wako wa Nyeri na show vinye uhuru ametusi Jacoma alafu mnatuma jamaa wenu wa Mombasa anaita Jacoma kijibu uhuru alafu sasa wasi tumekaa home nyi kazi yenu ni kuileta kwa screen moja si tuko hapo tumeketi so difference ni saa hizi eh, Jacoma anachukua simu anapigia ndugu yake mdogo wanakutana mahali wanaongea na mwambie hii kitu tunaweza fanya hivi na hivi. Hauwezi kuniambia kuna difference. Kuna time yenye jubilio alikuwa anasema kuna corruption Kenya. Unajua hivyo? Yeah. Sasa hii wanaeka watu pingu wakiwapeleka kotini. Hizo ni vitu ODM imewaambia wafanye. Si ati ni kitu ya kujigamba. <laughs> Kama mtu alikuwa na deny for instance ati hakuna ukabila hiyo time. Sasa hizi wana admit mpaka uhuru anaeka signature kwa ile MOU kati ya, ya Raila na Uhuru anakubali kuna corruption Kenya kuna ukabila Kenya na hizi issues lazima tuzizungumzie kiwazi ndio tusonge mbele hiyo ni achievement juu ukiangalia hizo ajenda yote tisa hapo hakuna ajenda ya jubilio ni ajenda ya ODM oh, kwa hivyo mko kwa baridi na mko kwa baridi as mko somewhere... ile kitu ile kitu naweza kuambia first of all atuko gava kama ni kuingia gava na unajua tulianza na hii kitu kuambia hatutaki kuingia gava that is not the intention kwa sababu watu ufikiria all the time politicians tu wao kwa tuna selfish intentions unacheki tukaambia tutaki kuingia gava hata saa hizi hatutaki kuingia gava tunataka hawa watu tuwapatia atmosphere unajua saa zingine uh, the best tool against your enemies also to provide an environment where they can feel okay. unaona peacefully without you wasiseme ni wewe unajua kuna time mwenye walikuwa oh. anasema oh hii maandamano yetu ndio ina, inaangusha uchumi sasa sasa hii uchumi ikianguka utalaumu uta nani na tuandamani si tuko tu hapa tumechini <laughs> i love the way you acknowledge that you are enemies but you are working together that's a very solid yes. point that's your confirmation. Yeah, we are working together right now, but we are not in government. We have decided to create an atmosphere where the uh, government can actually work on some of the difficult uh, issues of our time. Corruption, tribalism, all of those things. 